Alright guys, uh, I made a little, uh, 250, or, uh, dirt bike update, I just uploaded it, um, right here, I'll make a quick, uh, three-wheeler slash tractor update, <laughs> not that you guys probably care about my tractor, but, <laughs> I love it, so, uh, by the way, I'm sick, so, you know, kind of bear with me here, uh, this is a Case 446. It's a six, 18 horsepower Onan twin, dual exhaust. I got a 24 sitting over there for this thing whenever I, on my spare time. Uh, she got chains and tire or uh, chains on there. I have them on year round. I use this tractor for plowing, three point hitch for the ripper or the rototiller or you know. I pull my York rake too. That's how I build my MX tracks and stuff. You know. Needs new front tires. I'll probably get meaty tires instead of these uh, Garland tractor tires. I actually have another 446 in my shed that I mow the lawn with. And I have a 195, a 65 195 case. And that's just my show track. I mean, you can't do much with that. It, has, it doesn't really have much power. And uh, what else we got? We got a case 220. But, you know, they want the smaller tires, which is for sale, by the way, if you got any of you guys are interested. Um, oh, and uh, this thing is just a beast. I mean, whew, this thing could pull and pull and pull. As long as if she got traction, she'll pull whatever. I mean, even in high gear, I mean, the thing is unbelievable. That last uh, foot and a half uh, snow, uh, snowstorm we got here in New York... I, I plowed it with my dad's truck, but I left, like, the gravel I have, which is going to be blacktop this spring. And we're going to put, like, a little metal, you know, garage thing where the cars are. But, uh, you know, I didn't want to, you know, use my dad's truck because, it, you know, it's an old Fisher. It's, like, a 1,000 pounds. It would, like, rip the rock right out. So in a foot and a half of snow, frozen, this tractor pushed all that snow up and piled it up. It was amazing. I mean... This thing, Case, back then, they knew what they were doing. They really good uh, engineered tractor, that's for sure. It, it's just, it's really a piece of art. I mean, I have small, like, half-inch uh, wheel spacers. Because I use this tractor, like, you know, out in the woods and stuff. And I like it a little bit more wider in the rear. Um, I got wheel weights, 75 each. As you can see, the bolts are really long. Well, they, I could add another 75, so I think that's like 150 each tire, and that's like an extra 300 pounds, but that's too much. I, and you don't really need it, because this tractor alone is 1,000 pounds, you know? But, yep, that's the case. If you ever want a good garden tractor where you could rototill your garden, mow your lawn, and I swear, this thing puts nice lines, just like bobcats, and beautiful stripes. Uh, if you want to rake up an MX track, or if you want to build jumps, if you want to plow snow, this is the tractor to go, that's for sure. Beautiful tractor. Alright, let's get to, let's get to the 250R and wake up the neighbors a little bit. <laughs> oh, this thing probably won't even start. It's like 15 degrees out, it's been sitting out here. 1986 Honda ATC 250R. Just painted the motor. Uh, has a th I almost said 351 Windsor. Wow. I was thinking of the truck because my dad just sold it. 21 years my dad had this. 21 years yesterday. It's gone. 351 Windsor. Um, beautiful truck. Alright, I might cry. I better stop. Anyways. It, uh, 250R motor, it's ported and polished with a thir board 39mm car, board intake with a V-Force 3 reed cage, DG silencer, beautiful silencer, I love these silencers, polished rims, I did everything myself, it needs tires soon, it needs rear plastics, but that's really it, um, brand new forks, new frame, I gotta get new fender shrouds because they're shot. And that's really it. Uh, blue coolant hoses. I got it from my fatty pipe, but I want to upgrade to a pole turner high rev or if I can get my hands on an LRD, that would be nice.
This thing has unbelievable compression as a CR250 head gasket. Uh, we're gonna start her up. Uh, yeah, this might be. I don't know if it's gonna start. It should. Come on. You know, it is 15 degrees out. Oh, there we go. She's going to start. Paul Turner, high rev ported cylinder. This thing is a monster. And that's it with this. There she is, 86 to 50R, beauty.